Welcome back, viewers. You're watching World DNA with Raisha and me, Shivan. Let's get you started with the headlines we're tracking you at this hour. Nathan Yahoo says, and I'm quoting here, a tragic mistake was made in Israeli strike in southern Gaza's Rafa that set ablaze camp housing displaced Palestinians and reportedly killed at least 45. Iran further increases its stockpile of uranium, enriched to near weapons-grade levels. Watchdog IAEA says, adds that Raisi's death has triggered pause in talks with Tehran. Russia to build small nuclear power plant in Uzbekistan, first such plant in post-Soviet Central Asia, says Uzbek president after meeting with the Russian President Vladimir Putin. South Korea's military releases footage of what it says is the moment North Korea's latest attempt at launching satellite ended in failure. Papua New Guinea evacuates 7,900 as fears of new landslide grow. Meanwhile, government says more than 2,000 were buried alive in Friday's landslide. Bangladesh Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina makes explosive revelation claims she was offered hassle-free re-election in the January 7th polls if she allowed a foreign country to build an airbase inside Bangladeshi territory. At least 10 killed and millions left without power as severe cyclone Ramal lashes Bangladesh coast with devastating winds of up to 120 km per hour and storm surges inundating hundreds of villages. Mercury soars in northern India. Number of heat stroke patients in the state of Rajasthan climbed to 3,622 3, amid intense heat wave. 